Um, it's hard, honestly. Uh, you know, one of the things that I've done in the past is with injuries, I usually don't focus on them. I, uh, I kind of, if a kid goes down in practice, we go to the other end and keep practicing. You know, when Rach went down, um, it, 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 took, it took some heart away from us, honestly. And the, the reality of it is, and, and I told the team this on the first day, you know, Rachel was a vocal leader, but just like everybody else in the upper class and the upperclassmen, they all went to work hard, hard in the weight room, developing toughness, developing a team chemistry. And at this point, Rachel was a large part of that, but it didn't diminish everything else that everybody had done. Uh, we're playing for our, for our basketball team. We're playing for our university. We're also playing for Rachel. And, and having Sam back out there, I think, helps. Uh, but it, my heart goes out to the Bilney family. I mean, it's, it's not, forget me, forget our basketball team. I mean, you got two, a, a set of parents there that, that are dealing with this as well. And it's, it's, uh, it's just, it's, it's heart wrenching. Brittany, do you notice uh, a change in Sam since that happened? I mean, I know she's excited to get back, but then all of a sudden she sees something like that happen. How much? I mean, how much did you see any kind of a change in her and how much she would really like to, to step up and be, you know, a part of this program again, I, especially on the floor? Well, I do, I do believe that Sam, I mean, when she got into last year, I mean, she was, she was already fighting to come back. But once Rachel went down, I just felt like, you know, she, she wants to now just do it for her sister as well. Um, she, I mean, I just see her just, just fighting in, in therapy and just um, – being out there with us, just working really hard, you know, wanting to come back. So I definitely see a, a difference. Um, she, I felt like she's doing it for her as well as her sister as well. So, Brittany, as one of those seniors with all the freshmen, I mean, can you just talk about your role as sort of, one of the leaders of this team and sort of taking them under your wing a little bit? Um, <laughs> yeah, it's, it's exciting. Um, as Coach mentioned, I mean, the freshmen – they're, I mean, they're amazing. Um, they can help us out a lot. Um, but again, as a freshman, I mean, you, though you, you, you know, your skill, you still have some things to learn. As as I, when I was a freshman, and so I have to, to remember, I have to go back and remember. Okay, well, as a freshman, I didn't get everything, and um, you know, coach can definitely uh, contest to this. It, it, it's frustrating, you know. Um, but again, you have to to remember. It, when you was a freshman and when I was a freshman, you know, I, I didn't get everything as well. So um, they're great. They're a great group. I'm excited to work with them. And um, it's it's a challenge, but they're they're definitely coming along. So and the Scandinavian tour, like, that helped us a lot. So, yeah. Hey, Coach, can you talk about having somebody like Brittany around to help mentor these these freshmen as well? Yeah, I mean, it's, again, it's another invaluable thing. I mean, when you got when you got a uh, – you know, a senior that's been through as much as she has and has played as much as she has and, and understands what it is we're doing and, and goes as hard as she does, I mean, in, you know, in terms of effort. You know, one of the biggest things with freshmen is effort and, and consistent effort because the speed of the game and, and the challenges that you face in high school are just – they're not the same as, as college. So trying to get them to understand that, you know, 40 minutes at this level is intense and, and it requires a lot of focus and a lot of energy, mental and physical. Brittany brings that to the table. You know, by, by, by way of, you know, words and by way of every day when she walks out of the floor, she's going hard, she's, she's competing. Uh, they see that every day. I mean, the bottom line is, you know, if you're a point guard, you know, if you're an Amber Nichols on our basketball team and you got to play against Brittany Shells every day in practice, you know, it's either, you know, it's, it's either live or die. I mean, you, you know, you, you either buck up and, and get with it or, or, you know, Brittany just eats your lunch. You know, and, and that's a positive thing in the sense that Brittany uh, is being vocal and trying to help. At the same time, she, she's not taking it easy on them, you know, and I think that will only help Amber's development and everybody else's development as we move forward. And, and, and I've seen in the last three days, it, it, uh, there's been some dramatic uh, changes. In